Welcome back, it's Tech Teacher. Welcome to part lesson one, part two. And on this lesson, we're going to learn how to draw our own stage. So the first thing I do is go down and I have to select the stage. You'll notice immediately that there's a blue outline around the stage. It's very important that you select the stage, otherwise you won't be able to edit the background. So proceed up, click on backgrounds, in this case, we just have this background one. So I'm going to edit this background. And you'll notice that our paint editor will come up. Now, unfortunately, we cannot make this bigger. I would love to uh, be able to make this a little bit bigger. The, por the important thing here is, is that you're zoomed out all the way because you want to see your whole stage. You really can't see it very easily. You see I'm zooming in, but you really can't see much difference. It's a little easier when I clear it that you can see that these checkers are getting smaller as I zoom out. So uh, later on, as you start to draw your own characters, it's very important to be able to manipulate these zoom tools uh, and also manipulate with the brush sizes. So first thing we're going to do is, I think what we'll do is we'll grab a medium-sized brush, and I think I'll grab a color blue, go into my rectangle tool, and I want to make sure that it's hollow. So I hit it, the second option. I can then go to the top corner, left corner of my stage, and I can draw a nice boundary for the whole stage. Now I'm going to say OK for a minute just so that you can see what it looks like on the screen. Now you can see that our player is within a little box. So I go back to my stage, hit Edit, and this time I want to draw in some boundaries. Now I'm going to do this very simple, but you may want to do things differently. Now I want a brush size. This was the brush size we chose for the boundary. I would like a little smaller brush size. So I'm going to go down one. And I think this time I'll keep it black the way that's the, called the default color. I go to my line tool. Now to make a straight line, you have to hold the shift key down. So watch what I do. Keep in mind also that you have to have room for your cat to go. So I'm going to draw a little box here like so. And it doesn't have to be perfect. And again, I'm going to draw this box twice. But one right side up and one upside down. And I'm trying to draw it big enough for our player. But that's OK because our player can be smaller if we want. You'll see what I mean when I hit OK. I want our player, if you select onto the player, I want our player to be able to start up here at the right corner. So I'm going to hit my right key. And there he's going to start at the right corner. And I want him to go and get some prizes. So that is it. That is it for lesson one. Uh, two, uh, for part two, lesson one, and on lesson three, we're going to program the cat to get some prizes.